you want to make money in this presidential election, DJT is the stock that you guys want to be focusing on. DJT over the last 30 days is up nearly 200%. Isn't that crazy to think about? Take a step back here. DJT has now gone from $11 and has spiked all the way up towards $53. I mean, we have been stating this since September, since August, since July. Does anyone remember when we started seeing DJT even early uh, of the beginning of the year where we said, guys, DJT, get ready for the presidential elections. It only makes sense. As the presidential elections come on up, Donald Trump Jr. media is going to start getting more hype, more excitement, more activity, more followers, more investments. That's what, that's what happens here. So DJT has been a play that has been just roaring up, especially with some recent news. So what has been some of this recent news? Now, guys, as I always state, it does not matter if you are Republican, if you are Democrat, we are here because we want you guys to make news. So I personally do not care if you vote, if you don't vote, if you vote for Harris, if you vote for Trump, I want to make you money as an investor. So it says right here, DJT is skyrocketing ahead of elections. DJT is now up nearly 200% in the past 30 days as the presidential election gets closer. The excitement continues to grow and the hype is continued to build on DJT. That's one of the most important things. It doesn't matter what's happening with Trump, what he does in the polls. It's just hype. People are excited to vote if that's to vote for Trump, if that's to vote against Trump, if that's whatever. But the presidential election's coming on up and people are making money off the hype of presidential elections. So, it says, DJT is Trump media, which essentially is a way to invest or short against Donald Trump. Over the past week, Trump has appeared on the number one podcast in the world, The Joe Rogan Experience, which gathered 33 million views in one day, followed by one of his largest rallies ever in Madison Square Garden. All of this hype and media has been a reflection in the stock's performance. So traders, there are a few things that are leading towards DJT going on a 200% spike. And lastly, the last three days, the stock has gone on nearly a 40% climb where it's gone from $34 all the way on up towards this morning, $60. Number one is when you have a lot of attention, guess what? You can make money. Has, does anyone know anything about business? One of the big things that people say about business is you could have a great marketing team and you could sell poop and become a millionaire. If you have marketing, which is amazing marketing, which is great, you can have an awful product and you can still make millions of dollars. And the reason why is because if you can sell your product, if you can sell yourself, if you can sell your business, whatever it may be, and you can put yourself out there, you could be able to make money. So the thing is, DJT right here has great marketing. And what do we mean by marketing? We are saying that Donald Trump is honestly all over the place right now. We could start by number one, going over to Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan here. You guys could see Joe Rogan experience. In the last three days, this interview with Donald Trump has now gotten 37 million views. Regardless, if you love him, if you hate him, the fact is he has 37 million views in three days. What do you think is happening? This is now again leading towards this monster spike. Now, what else did we just see? We also know he just had his biggest rally nearly ever at Madison Square Garden. And that was on Fox. That was on CNN. That's, again, the talk of the town right now. So the thing is, guess what? More hype, more excitement. So while we have a 200% climb, while we have this move on up, while we have everything that's happening, we just have to realize that, guess what? Strong resistance is now coming on up the board. Now, guys, for anyone here that's saying, Deck, I don't want to do this because I don't like Donald Trump. There is no Kamala stock. There is no Kamala Harris play. There's nothing that you can get involved with Kamala Harris, you know, media. This is, again, the opportunity that we're discussing and that we're talking about because the presidential election. Now, I know, again, some people here absolutely love him and some people absolutely hate him. I do not care. All I want you guys doing is making money. So the thing is, 5650 is your major resistance sign. The major resistance continuing to spike, continuing to move, continue to climb right here. 5650 is where the rejection is most likely going to be at. Okay? So once you get above 5650, that is where you're going to have a much better opportunity to see that huge next leg on up. Now, Deck, why could we see that huge next leg? Because there's nothing really stopping it. If you want to think about it as I always think about like support and resistance as a house, I think about it as a floor and I think about it as a ceiling. Now, you guys right now, you guys might be on the first floor of your building or your house. You might be on the second floor. You might be on your third floor. But the thing is, whatever floor you're on right now, you are sitting on the ground. 
you are sitting on the floor. Now, if you look up, there's a ceiling above you, unless you guys are outside right now. But if you look up, there's a ceiling above you. You can't get through that ceiling. It's literally a ceiling right above you. Right now, this is the ceiling. You can see 5650, hit and fall, 5650, hit and fall, bounce off 5650. This is as clear as day that that is the ceiling right above us. Now, what happens if we do get above the ceiling? What happens if we take the stairs? Now that ceiling now turns into our new floor. And that's exactly what traders are going to look for over on DJT. DJT are going to say, hey guys, this ceiling, if we can get above this, is now going to be our new floor to see if this is going to spike, to see if this is going to rip, to see if this is going to run. So DJT, keep your eyes peeled on that. I'm gonna bring this up one more time, but as you guys always know, if you do wanna invest in any sort of way into Kamala stock, you guys can go over here. Right now, uh, t t there hasn't been much movement here, uh, but there is, this is, this is pretty, I always think this is so wild to think about. There is 906 million plays, or $906 million invested that Donald Trump's gonna win, and if you wanted to buy Kamala stock, there's 571 million. I mean, these are, so far, what do we have here? Uh, $2.5 billion invested. $2.5 billion. I just think it's so wild how many people are betting on who's going to win the, the presidential election. I mean, $2.5 billion here. I want to see top holders here. Let's see here. Look at this, guys. So we have top holders. Freddie 99 has 21,000 shares in here. Uh, 13,000. So let's just see right here. Uh, on Trump. Let's see. So let's go with the Kamala. Let's go to Kamala. The biggest holder of Kamala has 5.4 million shares. Oh my goodness. I don't even know how much money that would be. 33 cents. Let's just, uh, let's just do some quick math here. We have... Five four zero five one seven two divided by thirty three point eight. This person invested one hundred and fifty nine thousand dollars. So one hundred and fifty nine thousand dollars that Kamala is going to win. So how much is this person going to get paid out? One hundred and fifty nine thousand dollars if Kamala wins is going to pay out almost half a million dollars. Four hundred and sixty eight grand. So 468 grand. Hey, hey, good luck to everyone. Good luck to everyone here.